Hey y'all, it's Elliot, and you are watching my first year on T. And I'm back, baby. And, you know, I'm just, I don't have an excuse for not doing a video. I'm just kind of like shitty at YouTube and just been really busy. Um, but I'm back at it now with a video and, um, yeah, let's get into it. So today I'm going to be talking about where I see myself in five to ten years and what I hope for my future. So that's a big question and I don't really know. Um, and it's okay not to know. Um, right now I am 23. So in five years, five to ten years, I'll be cl close to 30 or early 30s, um, which is terrifying. <laughs> like, I kind of don't want to think about that. <laughs> um, but I hope to be doing something that I am passionate about. And, you know, that really sounds vague, but um, I feel like I don't have a passion, and it's something that I've always wanted to have, and I'm very jealous of people that, like, know what that passion is. Like, I love watching documentaries about people who, like, have hobbies or, like, who are really into, like, a sport or who, like, are obsessed with their job and, like, it's all about their job and stuff and they, like, live to work or whatever. Like, I want something that I, like, love to do and, like, don't need motivation to do just because I love it so much. And I feel like I've never had that. Like, maybe the only thing that I can think of is, um, when I played softball, um, in, like, high school and college. Like, I just loved it and, like, I wanted to play all the time and I wanted to get better and I loved going to practice and whatever. Like, that was something that I really had a passion for, but I feel like everything else in my life, I don't have a passion for, I'm just good at. And, like, like my job, like, I love to write, and I'm a good writer, and, you know, it pays the bills, and it's something that, you know, I don't hate doing, like, a lot of people hate their jobs, like, I do like my job, but I don't love it, and I don't have a passion for what I'm doing. Um, so I hope in five to ten years that, even if it's not my career, um, that I find that something that I'm passionate about. Maybe it's volunteering with, like, a trans people, or maybe it's, you know, being a dad, even. Like, um, having a family or something. Like, I don't know. Like, I just want something that, you know, I don't have to, like, force myself to do. That I want something that I love to do. And that, um, you know, every day I get up excited to be able to do it, or, like, a hobby, or whatever. Like, I don't know. And rambling now, but that's what I want for my future. A passion in something. Don't know what it is. Could be anything. Um, but I hope that that's what I'm doing. Um, I'd like to have a partner or a, um, like, girlfriend, um, to do fun stuff with. I mean, my philosophy on life is that life is fun and you're gonna die, so you might as well do everything you can to have fun and be with people you love. Um, so I hope that I have, you know, someone to do just crazy stupid stuff with and be lazy with and, uh, you know, just be in love, baby. <laughs> um, I also hope to have lived somewhere else. I really like Boston. I love this area. I love this city. But I grew up here, and, you know, I want to experience other places before I settle down somewhere or, um, you know, just try a new culture. I've always wanted to live, you know, in Portland or San Francisco or something, so maybe I'll do that for a year, and maybe I'll be there in five to ten years. Um, Transition-wise, I will definitely have had top surgery. I'm hoping that happens way sooner than that. I have a consult actually in October, so uh, I hope to have had top surgery for four years in five to ten years at least. Um, and you know, I'll be on T still. You know, it's for life, which is kind of crazy. But um, it's weird to think, you know, what am I going to look like in ten years on T? Like, I'm going to be, like, this man. Like, that's wild. Like, growing up, like, when I th thought of myself as older, like, I almost couldn't picture myself because I was trying to picture, like, a woman 
which is not what I was, so I couldn't picture it. And I never even considered that I could be this, like, man, like, this 30-year-old man one day. So I have just no sense of, like, you know, what will I look like or be like or sound like. Like, it's just crazy. Um, but yeah, so I'll have top surgery, probably be shirtless all the time, um, and covered in tattoos, I hope. And, you know, doing something I'm passionate about with someone I'm passionate about. That sounds like the dream to me. So, with that, I am going to go do some work, and I will see you guys in two weeks. I pinky fucking promise. I will do it. I am going to do it, because I am going to be one year on T in November. So that means that my time on this channel is probably ending soon, because this is my first year on T. And my first year on T is wrapping up soon. So I'm going to power through and I'm going to do it these next few months. Um, if you want to check out my 10 months on T update video, I will link that in the description um, to my personal channel. And with that, peace.